And now it's time for our Friday night movie. Tonight, INN film critic Jeffrey Lyons reviews Short Circuit. Jeffrey? Mort, I will not pull the wool over your eyes. When the director of Saturday Night Fever and War Games, John Batta, makes a movie I'm interested. After all, I pick War Games as one of the best films of the year when it was released. Too bad his latest, however, Short Circuit, which opens today everywhere, quickly lets you down. For this is just this infantile version of E.T., Splash, with a little bit of Starman mixed in. You know, lovable alien comes on the scene and quickly learns our pop culture, of course, by watching television, then has to flee intruding government agencies. I mean, how many times can we see this? Steve Guttenberg plays a government scientist who invents military robots. And when a bolt of lightning strikes robot number five, it thinks it's alive and flees the government complex. And befriends Ali Sheedy as a California free spirit. And here she and Gutenberg have teamed up and faced down the government, which wants to destroy number five. We gotta fry now, Howard. Don't you dare shoot your stupid guns! Where's number five? He's fine. He's in the van. Okay, okay. Why don't you and the young lady just get away from the van and let us handle it? Yes, Stephanie, get away. Danger. Listen, I know what the malfunction is. Sorry, Crosby. You can't take any more chances. We're not losing that thing again. Howard, if you just come over and inspect the unit, it's just ah! the best. You drove a defensive liar! As soon as they're clear, open the fire! What the hell have you done? Brother? I'll take care of this. Oh, you're not taking over. Don't no, listen. He's alive. I can prove it. See, it fails because they never explain sufficiently why the government wants to destroy the robot. Short Circuit has a few disconnected moments of humor, and it's passably entertaining, I suppose. But that wasn't enough for me. Guttenberg's too young, furthermore, for his role to be convincing, and Ali Sheedy recites her lines without any change of expression. The robot quickly loses its novelty. We see it too often, and the plot is by now familiar and derivative. Short Circuit. What got short-circuited here was originality and wit. This one fizzles. That's the Friday Night INN Movie. I'm Jeffrey Lyons. Mort? Well, thank you, Jeffrey. And that's the Independent News for Friday, May 9th. I'm Morton Dean. Have a good night and a good weekend. WPIX has news bureaus in New Jersey at 223 Montrose Avenue, Rutherford, and on Long Island at 3000 Hempstead Turnpike, Levittown. Coming up next, the start of something big.